mom. Hi. Um, it's the next day, aka Friday. Um, I think you've seen my latest video, but here I am again, just for a quick update. <laughs> it's currently 2.58 in the morning, okay? Now it's 2.59. It's 3 in the morning, and yesterday and today, I've been basically planning my future. <laughs> so, um, I've been looking at colleges and like their summer programs and things like that. And I've like made a document on um, different things that I would want to do. Like, there's three pre-college summer programs that I would want to do. Two in New York, one in Boston. Um, the one in Boston for sure though is the one I would want to do the most, which is creative writing. It would be like a five week course um, in the summer, just writing. <laughs> and then the other two were like fashion related. Um, then there's another one, which is an online program that I could do at any time of the year, not just summer. So I was like looking at that too. And I found that by accident actually. And then there's like a few colleges that I was looking into, like Emerson, I've been looking into um, since like last summer because that's when I first heard about their um, their summer program. So I was like, last summer I was like, oh my god, wanna at least do the summer program at Emerson, maybe go there, you know? And then there's like FIT, Parsons, Emory, and then NYU, probably not because. <laughs> NYU, please. Um, and then there are, there's this college summer program at Emerson, which I think Emerson is the school I want to go to because you'll see. Okay, so um, the college summer program at Emerson is like a three-week course um, in honor of Bobby Brown because she went there. And it's like all about makeup and cosmetology and stuff like that. And I was like, hey, what I like, okay? But like, I wouldn't want to do that as like a major or something that, um, I don't know what I'm trying to say. But like, it's in the summer and it's only three weeks, so it's like not really a commitment, which I like because I wouldn't want to like go to cosmetic school, you know? And then at Emerson. So what I would major in, I would major in creative writing, or something of that sort. I know, like, the five-week summer program is for creative writing in, like, what I would want to go to, because there's, like, different summer programs. Um, but I was looking at some of the courses, and they have, like, American Sign Language, so I was like, I, was, I would totally take that class, and, like, um, maybe minor in econ or something. And then, so if I go to school at Emerson, then, because the first college I ever thought about going to was FIT, right? So that would be for fashion and whatnot. So the only thing I would be missing at Emerson is photography and fashion business, which I can do in the summer, because FIT has a summer program. The one that I was looking at is pre-college, so it would be for high school students, but they also have for college students. Um... Yeah, so I've just been looking at colleges late at night and trying to find a path for my future. And then I'll help Charlie find her soon. But literally, like, three days ago, I had no idea what I wanted to do. But now I'm like, I want to go to Emerson. I want to take these summer programs. Like, the summer programs especially would be really important because it would look good on my college application and... It would be fun and experience, you know. By the way, Charlie, if you're watching, yes, I'll talk to you about this later because I know you'll ask. Um, anyway, that was my quick little update. Um, was it quick? Yeah. I don't know when you're going to watch this, but I don't know. I'm excited because, like, two years ago, I didn't even want to go to college. And then, like, a year ago, I was just like... I'll just, like, um, travel for a year and then figure it out, you know? And then, um, if 
this becomes less ugly. I can do like, um, whilst in high school, modeling stuff, which would give me money for like the summer programs and stuff because they're not free, obviously. And I really want to go to those, so yeah. And then I can't get a job yet because only 15, or I don't think I can get a job. And I also have to research internships and stuff that I could get. That would also look on my college application. Ugh. Adulting. Um, kidding, not adulting. And then today, I don't know why, I just wrote, this is before I made like a plan, like every single plan and stuff. I was just like writing and um, I was just writing like about how at 15, I already have to choose like what I'm, well no, you don't have to choose at 15, but like I'm ahead of the game because why not? Um, you're like choosing what you want to do and like it basically paves the path for your future and whatever so see to as interested I'll send it to you I was just writing it randomly because I, I wasn't bored because I have to read my stupid book I got a little bit ahead now I'm on page 202 so like 70 pages more than yesterday, which is not good, but it's fine, whatever. But I just wrote like a little over a page of how you have to decide what you want to do like at a really young age, and it's annoying. <laughs> yeah. What else? Ellen's helping me with school. She's like talking to people because I don't know anything about it. And me and Charlie have to get our tickets soon. I've just been thinking about college too much. I need to go to Sitges and just party. Um. I've been using this app. Didn't want to turn it off. And I use it every day. I've only been using it for like three days. Um, it's called Elevate. It's like um, this app to help you with not education, but um, like you do like little mini games every day to kind of improve your brain. Which we did something similar. I remember I was doing it with you couple years ago called Fit Brains and it's similar to that. Well, now I have them now. Yeah. Um, anyway, I've just been doing that. I also got this thing called Flow State and it's for like writing, writing stuff, where you set a time, either five minutes, 30 minutes, or an hour, and you have to write, or no, five minutes, 15 minutes, and 30 minutes. And you have to write non-stop, otherwise it'll erase everything that you've written. So it's like if you have um, writer's block or anything, you just like want to get ideas out, whatever, you use it so that you won't stop writing. And then um, yeah, so I've been doing like not many, not many of those, but a couple, just because creative writing. Uh, that path scares me. <laughs> um, yeah. I'll look at other majors though just to see, you know, get like some ideas of other things I could do. And then Emerson, let's check their acceptance rate. I think it was like 49 or something. And Evan goes there. And Sasha, this girl I watch on YouTube, goes there. Like, she talks about books and stuff. Um, Emerson. The, yeah, the accepted rate in 2015 was 49%. And shall I tell you some people that went there?
Okay, so like, oh, where did he go? Okay, like Jay Leno went there, and Bobby Brown, which I already mentioned, Dennis Leary. Um, I don't know who any of these people are. Jennifer Coolidge, that girl in um, Two Broke Girls, that's like with the nude, the noodles or whatever you call it, the noodles. Um, who else? David Cross, who was that actor in Alvin and the Chipmunks. I don't know what else he's in. Um, Kung Fu Panda 3, which I know you watched. Who else is, went to Emerson? Spalding Gray. I don't know who that is. Um, All these people that you probably know, but I just don't know any of them. Yeah. I don't know. But Jay Leno and Bobby Brown, you know? And then I was looking at also FIT and um, Michael Kors and someone else I forgot went to FIT, which is cool. Who was that now? Michael Kors, Calvin Klein, Nina Garcia, Ralph Rucci. All these people went to FIT. Um, and then at Parsons, Donna Karen, Mark Jacobs, Anna Sweet, Tom Ford. Alexander Wang. So that was one of the summer programs that I would want to go to. Because that's cool, you know? Let's just see some. Um. Wow, this video is longer than I thought it would be. I was just having a very inspirational college mindset recently, and I thought you should know because I might not be the disappointment child. <laughs> um, because I never knew what I wanted to do, and now I kind of figured it out, kind of not, I don't know. But definitely the summer programs will be very helpful to whatever it is I'm angling towards, whatever it's called. I don't know. My arms are from the gym and I didn't want to do anything. Um, and they also talk about this is where I write to my stuff and my ideas, like the thing about college that I was talking about, I wrote it down in here first and then put it on a Word document to make it like prettier and more less not English, if that makes sense, maybe not. Um, these dark circles under my letters, I never used to get those and now I do think it's stress and I sleep too much and when I sleep too much, I get really tired, which doesn't make sense, but that's how it works. I'm gonna probably read for half an hour and then go to sleep, because yesterday I went to sleep at like 5.30, and I shouldn't have done that, because I woke up at like 1.30, but I don't know. I tried to set an alarm, but it didn't work. I snoozed it twice. Still love Hamilton. Don't they perceive you? You, you, you. Okay. Which will leave you there with 15 minutes. I do. Love you.